With matrix getting their results, some may have got into different institutions already and some do not know what to do. So the market photo workshop is some of the institutions one can look out for if they want to pursue a career in photojournalism and photography. The school announced its newly fledged accredited foundation course in photography starting this month. So we are joined by the Market Photo Workshop Programs Manager, Kona Lamini, and uh, one of the alumni, Gabelo Mfugeng, to tell us more. Ladies, a very good morning. Thank you so much for joining us. Welcome. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having us. Great stuff. I'm going to start with you, Kona. Just what inspired the, mar the Market Photo Workshop to develop a fully accredited uh, foundation course in photography? So um, the conversation around getting accredited has, is one that the Market Photo Workshop went through for, for quite a while. Um, as an institution, we have been very fortunate to be quite immersed within the photography industry. Mm -hmm. Our facilitators are practitioners. Uh, a lot of our... Um, our assessors are also uh, editors. So our students have always been able to get work within the photography industry and also to work for themselves. We decided to get to go through the accreditation process to enable um, young people who can't afford uh, to study photography to, to then have access to other forms of funding. And another reason why we decided to go through the accreditation process is also to assist where, uh, as an institution, we've always been interested in making sure that we make, it, we make photography education accessible yes. as much as possible. Mm -hmm. So in some instances, uh, you'll find that there are people who think that because they don't have a matric, it means they cannot study photography. What this new accreditation of our foundation course is, means, um, we are accredited at NQF level four, which is essentially matric. So someone who was not able to get a matric can still come and they will have an equivalent accreditation to a matric. Okay. So what are the goals of this program? So the, the foundation course is really an introductory course into photography. So mm. we start off um, essentially with the basics, uh, the technical skills, uh, but also to start getting students to start thinking critically about image making and what that means. Okay. Mm. And then they start thinking around uh, possible careers that they can, they can go into because the, the landscape is quite broad. Yeah. One of the things... Um, that we, we try, one, what we are actually best known for is that we offer training in critical photography. So it's not just about pretty pictures, but it's about what do pictures mean? How do they influence society? How can they possibly change mindsets about things? How do they illuminate yeah. who we are? Yeah. Now, Cabello, uh, in, I mean, how did the education and experiences and the program that is offered at the MPW Mm -hmm. uh, help hone your skills and, uh, you know, just your vision about this industry? Um, so when I got to market for the workshop, I was there after trying to find myself in other institutions, but because of its affordability, I decided to go there. And I thought a, a skill that is very hands-on and technical and has a quick return on money would be a great way to rebuild my career. Mm. But what I found at Market Photo Workshop was academia, was critical thinking, was interrogation. Mm. And also paired with the professional practice skills that I got, I found myself in Market Photo Workshop getting more than what I actually set out to get. Yeah. And I found myself positioning myself in spaces that were not necessarily photo-based. I found myself in art history spaces at institutions that um, produced exhibitions that were very much about art history. And as someone that doesn't have a degree, I felt overwhelmed. But the tools that I was given at Market Photo Workshop to absorb and retain information helped me with um, delivering the information to the yes. people that I encountered yes. in the space. So I quite like, like what you said that, mm -hmm. uh, you know, some of the skills that have been imparted on you are yes. academia and critical thinking, which are very vital in this industry. So how have those skills helped you better prepare for the responsibilities and the complexities of this profession? So those skills prepared me for two employments that I got once I left market for the workshop, okay. where, like I said, I was able to break down and understand this information because of this critical thinking because of the theory around visual arts sure. and also a visual literacy. I found myself moving towards a curatorial practice but also business practice, working with artists as an artist myself, understanding where our shortcomings are in terms of applications. So I see myself as someone, because of the Market Photo Workshop, that is able to produce work but also that is able to work with artists from a business management mm. point of view but okay. also curatorial skills through the visual 
um, literacy that they offer at Market Photo Workshop. Okay. Now, Kona, you, you said that this program is, uh, is fairly old. It's been around for quite a while, but it's only recently been accredited. So what does that mean for those who've um, acquired the qualification prior to uh, admission to accreditation. That, does that mean that uh, their qualification will not be recognized? No, uh, not at all. Our qualifications are recognized within the industry. Uh, okay. In fact, our alumni have been very successful across the world, not just in, in South Africa, okay. uh, as practitioners. So in terms of the quality of the output it, that stays the same. Even with the new accredited course, we have not changed in terms of uh, what we expect when it comes to the output. The work is still the type of work, it's still the same quality as yeah. previously. How does a program bl blend practical hands-on training with uh, you know, the theoretics of this program? I think we're very fortunate that uh, the majority of our facilitators are practitioners. They're able to bring in their life experiences mm. within the industry. So it's not just based on the theory, it's based on their experiences as well and they're able to impart that to our students. Everything is about the doing. Okay, mm. so what are you currently doing at the MPW? At the moment, we actually, um, the Market Photo Workshop is the Africa partner for World Press Photo Contest. Okay. And as we speak, we have the Africa jury that is judging all the, the, en the entries from across the African continent for the World Press Photo Contest. So all the photojournalism work, documentary photography work that has been, accept uh, has been um, submitted by photographers from across the continent to World Press oh, Photo. Okay. So the jury right now is at the Market Photo Workshop going through all those mm. uh, applications to to arrive at a point where they can submit uh, Africa's best images okay. and these are all images that were taken in 2023 all right ladies lovely chatting to you thank you so much for joining us and Kabila see how thank you jumped you. in excitement at the mention of this contest <laughs> <laughs> makes me feel so great to be right. associated with this space <laughs> all right great stuff thank you mm.